Have you ever wanted to use Google Voice without looking at your phone or even touching it? This is Adam Lane from Pocket Now, and I'm going to show you how to do that on Windows Phone 8. Okay, so first off, I'm going to show you the app that I'm going to use. It's called Metro Talk. This is Metro Talk version 3.1. It's a little update that is coming soon, if you don't see it already. And um, if I go into the settings, there's a new option called Voice Commands. You have to go here after you uh, log into the app with your Google Voice account, and you've got to turn on the Voice Commands. Um, I already have it turned on, so now it's going to verify. And what this does is it looks at your contacts and then uh, creates its own little database to make voice commands work uh, more easily. And so I just you just have to turn it on and it looks at the contacts and sets everything up. So now let's just get out of here. I'll go to something else. And I got my uh, Bluetooth button, so I'm going to press that and we'll show you how it works. Metro Talk, text Eric Schmidt. Texting Eric Schmidt. Metro Talk is awesome. Heard you say Metro Talk is awesome. You can say send, try again, or cancel. Send. Sending message. So there you go, it just uh, sent a text message using uh, Google Voice. Now let's uh, get out of here again and we'll do a phone call. You'll notice that I have to say the name of the app first in order for the integrated speech uh, UI to know which app I want to use. So let's do it again. Metro Talk, call Eric Schmidt. Calling Eric Schmidt. So that's going to launch Metro Talk. And here's where it kind of breaks down a little bit. Uh, Windows Phone doesn't really allow third-party apps to go making phone calls by themselves. So this is a little confirmation. So I really I have to go and look at the screen and press the call button. That's kind of good because I don't really want third-party apps to do things that I don't know about. But it's kind of bad because now I have to press a button. One more time, let's press the Bluetooth button. And now I'm going to show you the help. So this is our integrated speech UI and if I go to apps we see uh, some of the apps that have speech commands and I'm going to look at Metro Talk and we can see what the options are for voice recognition. Now since I have Google Voice set up to uh, do forwarding call, incoming calls and text messages to my regular cell phone number, those will also be read aloud because I have the speech interface on Windows Phone 8 and that is right here. So when I have this on, incoming text messages will also be read aloud and then I can say reply and uh, use my voice recognition to reply to those text messages and they'll also go through Google Voice if they came from Google Voice. So you can have a Google Voice instant messaging, text messaging conversation pretty easily without touching the phone. So that's a quick look at the Metro Talk voice command and uh, speech UI integration. It's uh, pretty nice. That's coming in Metro Talk version 3.1. Should be released uh, pretty soon. Be sure to click the like button for this video, and that's it for now.